हेलो एवरी वन होप यू ऑल आर फाइन टूडे ऑन अ बिहाफ ऑफ सी सी टी वी डेस्क वी कम अप विथ न्यू वीडियो दिस वीडियो ऑल अबाउट अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट ऐप टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस विथ यू एन ऐप नेम एस केयर केम प्रो ऐप सो बेसिकली इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस विथ यू दैट वॉट इज केयर कैम प्रो ऐप वॉट आर इट फीचर एंड फंक्शन एंड देन विल टेल यू दैट हाउ यू गेट दिस ऐप and how you configure the app on iPhone to make the camera live and able to access all its feature so keep watching till end please like share our video please subscribe to our channel so let's start for downloading on your mobile phone you should open app store and search for care cam pro when you do this you find the here you find top of the list care cam pro smart ip camera and here you find the care cam app so basically you can add in both both app like care cam pro and care cam so when you install it first time then you should option like get when you already install and installing the second time option like cloud so i already installed it that's why i get cloud like option and if you are installing first time you should get option just click on get or cloud whatever you want so i just click on this cloud button and start downloading on my phone let the download load down downloading and installation to be finished now it is finish just click open click allow click allow click allow and here please sign enter the email address so you should enter the email email address if you installing first time then if you can sign up here is my email id just click continue and here is the password so i enter my password and click sign in again click allow while using app click okay now this is the interface of the app just click on this top right corner plus add button here you find the option qr code scan when you want to connect with with a qr code then you should scan here and here you find the add device and here you find the add group and ap mode okay so both options are i will tell you only those option which are necessary and which are useful so just click on the add device and here you find lot of option like wifi camera bluetooth wifi camera so select camera whatever you have like in my case i have a wifi camera just click on the wifi camera and here you find the three option okay one first and second option is important and another one is pair by ip pair by qr code so just click on search in lan so specifically search in lan is for when have you already when your camera is already connected to wifi network otherwise it don't detect like this okay this the device has a power adapter plug the device is plugged in network cable your smartphone and ip device are in the same local network it means that if your camera is connected to the wifi with some other app and you are searching here then you can do so basically this is not a very useful option first two option is very important so i will tell you the first method pair by ap connection so why this is when you have no no router router no wifi no internet access and you want to connect the camera by using its own wifi then you have to use pair by ap connection okay means if you if you don't have router if you don't have any internet over premises and you simply install the camera and it, it and and put a sd card and you want to connect by its wifi so it is only used when you are in this camera zone camera wifi zone okay so so be clear and pair by qr code is used when you want to connect the camera by using your internet means it can you can access the camera you know, on the same place where the camera is installed and also at other place by using your data okay if you are connecting by 
QR code. So I will explain first option pair by AP connection. Okay, then by PR code. I will tell you the pair by QR code first. Okay, because it's come first in the row. Just click on this. Here, what you should do, you should click on the reset option button. Reset button is the button when you pull the camera just over on the memory card place, you find the reset button. Just if I will show you by in, in video then i will definitely i going to start my camera and show you so you pull the camera over there here you find the reset button just click on that for a two or three second this sounds done and after some time you found a LED, led flash this this is saying in the screen okay like first when you plugged in you will have a voice alert in include indicating power then press the reset button three or five seconds to reset the device until a beep so you see that we are listening a voice welcome to use and again you see here the voice welcome to use just click confirm and click next step here you find a very interesting thing this camera supports only 2.5 gigahertz network so i connect currently i have my wi-fi have 5G connection or 5 gigahertz. So I switch my Wi Fi to 4 gigahertz. Okay. 2.4 gigahertz. Here it is. I, so I just switch to my, my connect my mobile phone to 2.4 gigahertz and then go to the here it connected and now I should enter my password. click done and click next step now you should see the qr code now your camera will see that this pr code then it will connect it like you in on the screen you see 10 to 20 10 to 20 centimeter you see your camera lens see this this qr code or you should put your phone 10 to 20 centimeter away from the camera lens okay so now i do this Now I hear a voice, just click on this, I hear a prompt, after that it start connecting. Okay. Now disconnect to the server, now put any, any device name like living room or front yard, whatever you want and click ok, done. Okay. Here you find uh, two screen. One is HD, and there is so you change the change it by clicking function. setting here you find screen mode split screen mode just click on single screen mode now when you see the camera your camera now click save now when you click save you Okay, become very clear when PTZ option is there if you want to tilt the camera if you want to zoom the camera you can control everything from here okay and second one is if you want to record the live view of the camera on your mobile phone just click on that here you see that in red color recording start when you again click on the camera recording stop and it will say it will save on your local album now click on the screenshot third button is the screenshot a bulb like uh, icon just click on that basically is this, this camera have both uh, ir led and flashlight led 
so if you want to turn your uh, wi-fi led on on the night board and then you can change the setting from here okay just click on the led light on and here always on when you click and click save okay your camera led will come on okay like this you can see the screen flashlight will stop and not ir light will enable okay now the fourth option and final option is that the So thanks for watching, thank you, thank you, have a nice day.